Hey, welcome back to Good Day, and welcome to Michelle Mayers from Lazy Dog Restaurant and Bar. Uh, you got three locations. You've got Addison, Plano, and Euless, and uh, we've both been to them. And yeah. Love Thumbs them. up. I yeah. love that there's so much to choose from on the menu. And we the dog-friendly patio. Oh, you like that, too. I yeah. She, she approves. Yes. <laughs> I approve. <laughs> Definitely Thank approve. You. What are you making this morning for us? Well, we're making our um, apple huckleberry open face pie. Oh, something that little, sounds delicious. Something a little different for Thanksgiving to spice okay. up everybody's dessert table. Right, because we know the apple pie, everybody does that. Huckleberry, kind of, a, kind of a one that you don't hear very much about. Correct. Okay, let's share the secret. What do we do? Okay, the first thing we have, we have our Granny Smith apples. Okay. And you have your Granny Smith apples, you add your sugar, your cinnamon, you want to mix it together. Now you've cooked these. These are all cooked. cooked. Okay. And then you come over here and this is our wild huckleberries. And you place your huckleberry with your sugar. You want to cook it over medium okay. until the berries burst right. oh. and the sugar slightly thickens. Okay. Okay? And then after that, you want to make sure you blend it so that it's super smooth. Okay. Make sure you get all the seeds out. Okay. Makes sense. Once all right. you're done with that, it's very simple. Let's turn this baby off. We're going to take one scoop of our huckleberries. Isn't that beautiful? And if you don't find huckleberries, blueberries would probably work. Oh, uh, yes. You can substitute blueberries. Not a problem at all. Okay. Then after that, you're going to place one scoop or one cup of your apples. Yum. Oh, it's so delicious. And then this is the best part. So you're going to take it, here you can yeah. take it, and make sure, excuse me, you want to show the apples. Okay, at the top. So you want to leave about a four inch diameter. Okay, so how do we so fold just this up? However you want, slightly, okay. press down, okay. and then you go in, and then you come in. Oh, I and see. just go all the way oh, around. Okay. And you don't have to make it perfect. That's the fun part of it. You just want to make sure everything is contained so it's not all over the cooking sheet there. Absolutely. There yeah. But if it is, you just pop it in your mouth. <laughs> right. <laughs> it's for the chef. There you there go. go. That's Beautiful. perfect. And we put a little egg. Is that egg? A little egg wash. On? Here. Because yeah. what you want to do, you want to baste it. Let's get that off. And that's there. just so it doesn't, it browns. Yes. You want that Nicely. golden brown plus it seals the sugar. Perfect. That looks great. We're going to put a link to this recipe and a, uh, a link to Lazy Dog Restaurant and Bar. Again, Addison Plano and in Euless as well. And what are you finishing that oh off with? Oh, my gosh. The sugar. That's Some sugar the best on top. part. Uh -huh. It always makes everything better. Be Love generous that. with your sugar because it's the holidays. Right. And a little bit of caramel so topping on top of it looks like. Yes. Yes. And absolutely. then you want to Perfect. bake it for 350 degrees. Bake it for 350 for great. 10 minutes. And Rotate it. And then bake another five to ten minutes. Recipe on the web. We have